because it is so important if we're serious about tourism. And that's one of the products that we can add to our tourism marketing. The, the uh, uh, tourism marketing uh, has to incorporate all the city's attributes. And then amongst that, we'll throw in the fact that we're hosting the Commonwealth Games. And let's go out there and sell the city. And it needs to be sold with passion, 100% uh, on board. Um, thanks, Jeff. Uh, I agree that we do need the Waterways Authority and it should be funded from the money that comes from the leasehold of the land, the Crown land, or the spit as it was, and the money's been going into consolidated revenue, so there is no money that's been uh, allocated for a waterways authority. I have been involved with the dredging and the kickstarting of the dredging. Uh, we've got uh, dredging out the seaway, so we have been able to bring the tipper boats in. We have been able to bring in and lure big races to the city, which we will continue to do. But I, I think, I agree with you, it doesn't need bureaucrats on it, it needs business people. Business people who are tourism focused, who are marine focused, and who know the flow-on benefits it will bring to the city. Um, happy to see a cruise ship terminal, love to see it somewhere on the Broadwater uh, parklands or around that area uh, of towards Labrador that people can drive down Brisbane Road and get on and off the ships. I don't believe we should have a, uh, a ship uh, pulling out in the ocean. I think we need all the proper dairy and everything to, to happen from the city. It needs to be a, a place where we get on the boat, not just get off the boat. Um, Doug Jennings Park, is uh, going under my mayoralty will become a big, uh, like a river stage, so we'll have boats coming to and from Dojin Park, which will mean that we'll have to uh, to uh, spend some more money organising uh, new pontoons around for commercial activities and, and for ferries. So I'm more than happy to cooperate with the business community in, in enhancing the broad water in the marine industry. Thank you. Could I, uh, talk to you? Yeah, sure. Just from a um, I'd like your Boaties. One that's run aground and the ones that will run aground in that world water. I mean, it's as simple as that. In 08, I, um, running for mayor back then, um, I cornered um, the then uh, LNP leader, Lawrence Springboard, and I said, got up, black dude, got up and asked the question, we want our own water authority. And at the end of it, he gave the commitment that uh, we will get it. Unfortunately, uh, they're not elected. But that mantra and that push should continue on, and we get the Gold Coast Waterway Authority. But with that, on that board, why I was so passionate at the time is that you look at the uh, current uh, people who makes the decision on our board water, they really live in Brisbane. They could give it whatever. What happens here about the dredging, decision on dredging, or is there a master plan? It's been neglected. So the core here, when we do establish our Gold Coast Waterway